So we're here at the 2024 Florida RV Super Show and we're checking out the New Camp Cirrus 920. Let's take a look at this amazing truck camper. As we step up in this beast, this thing is massive for a truck camper. It's spacious. Right when you enter, you've got your bathroom right over here. And believe it or not, you not only have your toilet and sink bowl, but you've got a full shower in this truck camper. Wow, look at that storage space right to your left when you come in. You can fit all of the things you need in here. Oh boy. Huge pull-out pantry for all your canned and boxed items and whatnot. That's pretty dang cool. You've got a full complete kitchen in here. You've got a two burner induction cooktop. You've got a massive sink that you can fit regular size pots in to actually clean them. And you even have an oven. I'm honestly shocked for this being a truck camper. It's pretty incredible. And just when you thought you might be missing a little something, you open this up and you've got a microwave in here too, so you have all the pieces to your kitchen. And let's talk about storage. Storage, more storage. That's just your upper. You come down, you've got multiple drawers here to fit everything you need. And if you look up above you, they did some really nice lighting in here that really gives it a nice ambiance and it is flickering a little bit because of those are LED lights, but it looks good in person. And before Brittany shows you the dinette, right above her head is a Truma Aventa, I believe. AC, very quiet, really efficient. Over here, you've got your nice spacious dining area that you can even plug in some USBs back here, so you can use it as a workspace too. Not to mention that, of course, this also turns into an extra bed so you can bring more people with you on your adventures. You've even got a separate fridge and freezer combo here with a lot of space. And in the back, you've got a beautiful queen-size bed with no shortage of storage on each side of you. And as you can see, you have wardrobe storage, you have side storage right here, cabinetry up above everywhere as well as a tv right here so let's check out this series a this thing is pretty dang cool looking from the outside let's take a look on the inside I'm crouched down here just so I can be eye level with Brittany standing outside. But as you enter to your right, you're gonna see you have a bathroom area, shower, toilet, all that. Pretty spacious, actually really spacious for a truck camper. To the left, you can see storage. Right past that storage area, you can see you have a microwave. You have your kitchen countertop, which is pretty spacious with a Nice Keurig on it. Lots of storage. You have a big sink right here, along with a three burner cooktop and oven. And as you can see, you have Truma right here. So it looks like you're using for heat and hot water, Truma. My head's crooked right here. This is a very large step up. So Brittany's at the lowest section, then there's a step up for the kitchen area right here, and then another step up so you can get to the bed comfortably, but also storage. So as you can see down here by my feet, tons of storage, these all open up. This whole floor area opens up for storage. That is a great use of space in a truck camper. And a very large couch area, lounge area that can fit three to four adults comfortably. So that is a, a bonus. And I'm not sure if this folds out. It looks like it may, 
but I'm not sure, so don't quote me on that. And behind me, up above, you can see you have lots of uh, storage here, different cabinetry. And then past that, you can see you have the large bed. So this mattress is actually smaller than what the bed allows, looking at it. So I believe you can definitely fit a queen here, maybe larger. And above the bed, you can see there is a very large skylight along with windows on both sides of the bed. So it's very bright and makes it seem very spacious in here. And right at the foot of the bed, you can see there's a TV and it is on a swivel mount. So you could probably swivel that and watch it from the lounge area. And right next to the bed, you can see the freezer fridge combo. Pretty good size, especially for a truck camper. And here around the whole outside, it's actually built on a flatbed with tons of storage. So you have storage on both sides everywhere and also underneath the uh, upper bed sleeping area. You also have some big storage here. So pretty impressive. And if you were full timers, this truck camper is a pretty solid option. So we are here with Storyteller Overland and Global Expedition Vehicles, and this is their hilt. So let's go check out this beast. So we are here inside the Global Expedition Vehicle Hilt, and man oh man is this thing made to go basically anywhere. It is on the Ram 5500 Crew Crab chassis, so this is a 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel, so this thing is a beast. So when you step in, you have immediately a two burner induction cooktop, which is really nice and spacious. You have a gigantic kitchen sink. You have wireless charging and outlets right here in the middle, along with some space to dry some items. They actually have some indented slats right here to drain water right into the sink. And ton of storage below. I mean, like a ton. You have trash right here and recycling, so that's nice. And then of course, just multiple drawers everywhere to store all your kitchen items. Up above the kitchen galley area, you also have just literally a whole line of cabinets that span all the way to the back of the rig and wrap around your dinette area. So speaking of dinette area, look at this. You could easily fit, I mean, one, two, three, four, five adults pretty comfortably but I would say if you really wanted to get shoved in here and have a party, you could probably probably get seven or eight. So that's pretty impressive. And this rear dinette actually converts to a queen size bed, but this isn't your only sleeping area. We'll get to that shortly. This is a really cool corner cabinet that opens. It's just got a bunch of stuff in there from the storyteller team's travels. So it's like cleaning supplies, so I don't want to open that up. But in front of that, you have your really amazing soft close refrigerator and freezer and these have the slam latches which are just amazing if you've ever seen an rv or you have one with that slam latches you know it's staying closed above that you have a convection microwave so you can uh, do your, your oven cooking that you need. And it's pretty good size. And here you can see the bathroom. It's a wet bath, pretty large and spacious. And here's that other sleeping space. So above the cab, above the chassis, you have a queen size bed up here with some really big windows. So you're not lacking when it comes to sleeping options, that's for sure. And alongside both sides of the bed, there is storage cubbies. So you have plenty of storage for all your items. We usually don't say prices in our videos because they just vary all over the place. But if you're familiar with Storyteller, they actually have see-through pricing. So now that they are you know, with Global Expedition vehicles, they have see-through pricing on this. The price of the Hilt 
is 446,000. So if you're a millionaire, pretty good weekend option. Or if you're somebody and you're selling your house with the way the market's crazy right now, and you wanna go full time, this is an option. So tons of exterior storage, of course, and big molly rack, molly panel back here, along with your gigantic 335-80 R20 tires, uh, military style. So you're, uh, you're kitted for the uh, apocalypse or for doomsday on this one. So really cool option by a global expedition vehicle if you're looking for a, a pretty pricey toy. About to leave, already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see.